Greetings Sabre fans, it's your old pal Meg2 Sit. And what I got here for you is my latest project. So all my projects, all my um, Sabres that I'm working on, um, they go in boxes like these and basically the hilt and then all the components needed to install are in there. And um, I don't know if y'all can see what's inside the box, but it is a Master Replicas Anakin Skywalker hilt. Now, I bought this hilt from Albert Flores of Smuggler's Outpost Custom Sabers. And, you know, he sent it to me and he said, look, there's a lot of problems. The gold button here was fried. The gold button here was fried. Of course, it needs the TCSS adapter, which I'll show you all in a minute. And, you know, the, the, the clamp card was missing. And something he didn't tell me was that the pommel cap was missing too so I have to figure out a fix for that but the bottom line is that um, you know I knew this was a project saber but these MR sabers you know I can turn them around and fix them up pretty quickly this is the custom saber shop conversion kit that goes inside the Anakin MR you can see the you know the holes for the Graflex pins um, basically from what is the Graflex clamp back you know, this all needs to be painted black, and this hollow in here needs to be painted black. The, the buttons that were in it are absolutely horrendous. Um, here is the, the, um, the Graflex button tab that was in it, and this is supposed to be the gold button. And it's like totally fried and melted. I don't know who tried to do something with this, but it's absolutely a mess. And I already have a plan for that. So my plan is that I'm going to use a Graflex 2.0 button bezel and button with a functioning button. And I'm actually going to, uh, you know, put this, I'm going to be painting this gold. And that's going to go here. And that's going to be your ignition uh, and retraction on Nano Biscotti. The clamp, what's left of the clamp, I have a lot of work to do on it. I have a clamp card on order, sloth furnace that will you know go inside of this clamp and then I'll reaffix this of course the gold's all worn off of the the old on off switch and I don't know if I'm going to keep that on off switch or just glue that solid uh, you know with nano biscotti with deep sleep you don't really need an on off switch but maybe I'll, I'll keep that functioning it, it, it really doesn't matter to me so as I said all this is getting nano biscotti in a MHS V6 chassis just like my other MR Anakin's and I wanted to show you a solution that Shamim sent me the idea on which is pretty cool So you know in Shamim's in Shamim's shop uh, they actually sell the he actually sells these gold button solutions for these and I can't remember if this is the right piece or not so you know there's a new gold button and the new gold button of course will go here on the bottom of the saber the only thing is is the gold button housing is all messed up so I'm gonna have to clean it up but the gold button is nice and shiny the only thing not shiny on that gold button is the sticky that's on it which I still gotta take off from the factory from where I got it thank you to Shamim for filling me in on that and of course this is gonna get blue blue white neopixels driven by the Nano Biscotti 4 so I have to fix the clamp I have to fix the paint on the clamp bar I have to fix the button in the bezel, button bezel and make this a gold button and this will actually be a functioning activation so the main activation of the saber will be the gold button which will be pretty cool I don't know if I'm going to keep that slider switch going in this clamp or not I have to fix the pommel and of course she needs all new guts and man this thing is nasty on the inside dirty it looks like this thing's been in a storage shed so I know why Albert, you know, wanted to sell the Sabre. I'm sure he bought it thinking, hey, I'll do a quick turnaround on this. And, you know, he saw how bad in condition it was and said, yeah, somebody else can do this project that he wasn't into it. So I'm taking this thing on. We're going to turn this, you know, poor Master Replica's Sabre that's been abused and misused. We're going to make her nice again. We're going to make her pretty again. And this will be a fairly budget saber. It's going to have in-hilt LEDs, no, no teensy saber, no neopixels. This is going to have in-hilt LEDs, blue-blue-white tricree. It'll be a budget-type saber. I'm hoping, 
you know, to sell it at, at, at budget prices for the install. And basically I'm taking an old washed up MR that's been lying around in everybody's saver boxes and garages for years, and I'm going to turn this baby into a uh, somebody's pride and joy in their collection again. So I'm pretty excited about doing this conversion, and I'll shoot more video, you know, as the project progresses. May the force be with you.